In this video, I will provide you the steps for importing and exporting using the Import Export feature for Magento Enterprise. Go to System, Import Export, Export. Entity type, you would select the entity type you want, whether it's products or customers. And this is to export a CSV of the products. Export file type. The only option currently available is CSV. Once done, you would then be able to filter out a specific product or range of products based on certain attributes. If you don't want to filter out any specific products, you can skip the filtering process and click continue. Once clicking continue, CSV will generate and based on your browser settings you should be able to then download the file. Open the file. And as you'll see, all your products are in the CSV. You can then remove all any row or all rows that you want and make changes to whatever products you want and whatever attributes you want. However, the first row must remain as this is the attribute codes and is necessary in a CSV. Once you're done editing your CSV, you can save it. And then you can then import it. To import a CSV, you then go to System, Import, Export, Import. For entity type, you select the type, products or customers, depending on the CSV type. You select the import behavior, whether it's to append complex data, replace complex data, or delete the entities. Appending complex data means you're adding t data on top of the currently existing data. For some attributes, it will actually replace the, the data. Others, it will just add adi the additional data to the current data. Replace existing comp complex data will replace whatever data is currently with the product to the new data that's in your CSV. And delete entities will delete the products in your CSV that you are importing. Once you've selected the import behavior and the entity, you click choose file, select your CSV, and then click check data. The system will check the CSV. If any errors are found, it will inform you of the errors and which products some are not supported, such as um, some products are not supported for the import. Others will be skipped. If it's not supported, it'll be skipped. Once you've checked it, and if the CSV is cleared, you click import. If you if there's errors that you need to fix, you can fix your CSV and then repeat the process for importing. Otherwise, click import and the CSV will then be imported into the system with exceptions to the rows that it skips. That's the steps for importing and exporting CSVs within Magento Enterprise.